Hello and welcome back to another episode of Wasteland 3. My name is Saiken and today we're continuing the blind playthrough of Supreme Jerk Difficulty episode number 38. Time is flying and we're still trying to get Vicky Buchanan. Uh, this time we're jumping right into the action uh, from where we left off the last time. I needed to cut the episodes into a little bit more digestible chunks because it grew just completely out of hand. But we're going to go uh, start right with the medical center, hopefully this time without making enemies. Uh, episode 38, still only two death so far, and let's jump right into it. All right, back in the saddle. So we got ourselves the exact same outcome. I just didn't want to attack uh, innocence. Call me crazy, but sometimes mistakes are being made and I just don't want to be that guy who is destroying everyone and everything. The gift has scaling vapors can for a small fee. Okay, what does this guy have? First aid station. Deploys a first aid station. Ooh. Oh, that's a cool item. I like it. That's actually a really good item, but... Uh, hmm, you know what? Let's take two of them. Maybe for a super hard fight. Oh no, I uh, don't touch it. I get it. I don't touch it again. I am not touching anything right here. Be careful, everyone. You're fucking dead, you bitch. Just wait until I get out of here. I'm gonna cut off your fingers and shove them up your ass. That's some serious threats right there. We're starting with Frozen. Sentra moves up, gets the Storm a perk. Couple of nice hits, I like that. Hogbite inspires everyone else. One hits often and very hard. Nice, nice, nice. Very good hits. Headshot. Not a kill. Oh, come on. Hogbite oh, charges in. <clears throat> Unfortunate. But these guys are tanky, but I think we're okay. Ah. 
Nice, crit resisted. He would have taken a crit, but luckily we do have crit resistance. Which not only reduced the crit, but saved Hogby. See? Crit resistance, super important. Speaking about Hogbite, one, two, big fat thundering strike, uh, she's taken out, oh she has 4500 hit points, <laughs> it's okay, uh, yeah. Quam gets a Stormer perk and takes a couple of extra shots. Lovely. We're going slightly out of the way, mainly because I don't want to be hit by that massive. Gun. Um, resisted marked. How could anyone ever resist marked? Great hits from Ramos. I like that, by the way. Please crunch the. Uh, mm. Crunch yourself down. <laughs> Armor broken. And we're good. Gertrude, on the other hand, is not good at all. She's doing quite poorly. That weapon is brutal. Absolute massacre of a weapon. Okay, Lucia, I think we're just continuing with awareness that'll. Uh, improve our gun skills. His ass soon level 9. One more level for that. And we're saving for counter offense. Flaya level 15 bladed weapon. Well, we got better weapons. This now, I would have guessed. Anyone who is guarding this door here would have a bit of a better weapon. La Loca, woman in ranger gear, take us out of the freezer, seems to have lost some fingers to frostbite. Uh, yeah, you're, you lose uh, your fingers in the uh, freezer. It's fine. All I need is the middle one. Air yes, we came here with a convoy. And it took you this long to come looking for us? Oh, God's fucking tits. They put me in this freezer to cool off after I kicked Vic in the sack. <laughs> <laughs> Funny, right? And some greasy, shit-licking chick's been cutting on me for days. Calls herself Gertrude the Gruesome or some such shit. Wait, uh, she's not dead. Afraid so, she attacked us. I see her. Fucking balls. I wanted to murder her. Name's Laloka, by the way. Give me a sec to get my shit together and I'll get moving. And once I do... Might drop this fucking badge and walk all the way back to Atchison territory. You're not doing bad for someone who got tortured. What? This? The missing fingers and toenails and stuff? Ain't nothing. Oh, wow. These shitlords are fucking amateurs. I mean, take a finger right away? Where the fuck you go? I tried to fucking tell him. Look, you gotta build. 
slices, cut, gouges. But I told him, bitch, I chewed on that knuckle when it was still attached. And I'm pretty fucking hungry right now. Thanks for the dinner, motherfucker. Nod on that pinky all night and ask for seconds. Oh, wow. She is indeed loca. Loco. Uh, can, uh, can we bandage you up? Nah. You gotta let the wounds breathe. Everyone knows that. Okay, we got it for him sure, here. Sure, why not? Right after I raid the kitchen. I'm fucking starving. She used the F word for probably 400 times now. Very good. Combat started. Surprise, motherfuckers. We're home. And that's gonna hurt you more than it is going to hurt us. Because guess what? Um, we're charging in to here. Then for shits and giggles, uh, you are going to get a free shot. Then, we're going to take your robot. So what you gonna do about it, huh? What are you going to do about it? Nothing. I thought so. Quan, church is over. And Quan, ah no, he, can't only, he can only storm once. I already learned that. My bad. Charge over here. Every single one of you is terrified. I love it. And whilst we're at it, suppressing fire. Very good. You see a charge is up. First thing first, you three are stunned, like the clowns you are, and then whilst we're still at it, nice, good job. Central charges. Gets the Storm a perk. Hits. Follows everyone. Murphy takes a good chill pill over here. Moves to here. And let's just heal ourselves. Nice. All right, we bring the party in uh, inside. Oh. 
I wish all of those guys would be ranged, because they are oftentimes just really in the way. take a couple of kills central gets this guy down follows with a couple extra hits one two three Leader multi kill. There we go. This is how we do it. No, 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 no. out the ball uh, barely not enough Good job. Junk, 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 junk. Couple of keys and junk. Creepy doll, melee attack bonus. All right, the game will is trying to appease me. Should be giving medical aid before moving him any further. Near moments after he stabilizes him, he takes a deep, respiring breath and notices you for the first time. <laughs> Finally, fucking made it, huh? Finally found the time, assholes. Say nothing. Uh, this shit's my fault, not yours. Couldn't keep my mouth shut. Never could stand bullies. Anyway, you came for me, and I won't forget that. I guess you took out the guards. Bastards ain't so tough now. Check his wounds. Uh, hands off. I'm fine. Where's Vic Buchanan? Patriarchs. It's gonna be hard for you to get inside. Heavy security. And you already head for the lobby. Just, uh, got arrested before. <laughs> It's okay, Pris. You can do this. Just close your eyes. I can't do it. You have to, Pris. Do it. One of us has to make a run for it. Ladies, it's me. Lucia, remember? We'll find a way to get you out of there. I promise. Lucy? But you look so cool. Look at her, Violet. She's got scars now. <laughs> She's a proper wasteland warrior. How long have you been standing uh, here? I don't know. Maybe three days. I don't remember. 
It's hard to keep track of things when you've been awake this long. Can we just replace your weights with heavy objects? Uh, it won't work. Victory already thought of that. If the weight is off by so much as an ounce, it'll trigger. Uh, that would be a pretty uh, unconvincing story because your body is burning calories. And if you're there for three days, you would have lost excluding sweat and um, assuming that you still have your excrements and so on but you would have lost uh, one and a half kilos which is more than an ounce uh, so good idea but bad writing we have to look around and see if we can help you Right cross terminate in the metal box front panel looks easy remove the panel revealing a nightmarish tangle of wires whoever put this device together was either in a hurry or had a very little idea what they were doing look for a way to disable it uh, the mess of wires is impossible to untangle but uh, the shooty worksmanship also makes the device easy to short circuit using several bits of metal and engineering now how you interrupt the flow of amazing. electricity <sighs> Why didn't we just pull the wires coming from the box? Because you're standing on plates and that is like five meters away. Wouldn't be Duh. that easy, ladies. Stuff like that only works in store. Oh, and um, Lucia, I I'm sorry about Isaac. He's an idiot. I know. Where are you heading now? Uh, away. Our mother is here too. She's in the Patriarch's wing with Victory. She's not pleasant and she doesn't much care for us, but if you can... Session 13, Jim and Nancy, March 21st, 1998. Nancy, last time you were talking about Jim's inadequacies as a sexual partner. Would you like to expand on that? Now wait just a goddamn minute. You've let her talk for 12 sessions straight. When's my chance? See, Dr. Meltzer, this is what I'm talking about. Everything's always about him. Why the hell am I paying for these sessions when you're always oh, you kidding me? her side? If you're unhappy... Unhappy? I wish the fucking bombs would fall, so I wouldn't have to deal with another minute of this. What's that noise? I don't know. Maybe some kind of drill? Oh no, is that... It can't be! Oh, thank God. Well, I guess he got his wish. The bombs were falling. And we got poisoned once again. Good. Absolute hell of a job, Saiken. Well done. Us yet again a lot of medication. Fantastic. Okay, let's continue our corridor. good we're immediately starting up right charges in and gives this breathe a uh, breather here a good punishment before taking cover Murphy, my good friend. It's over for you. Fuck. 
Flame tank, 60% chance of blowing up. That's what I'm talking about. Followed by a nice little trick shot. That unfortunately missed, but Murphy did well. What? How's Hogbite dying in one go? Alright, whatever it was, not cool. So here almost gets that guy down. Central has his first kill. Followed by taking the position on the other side. Ramos begins to lay a trap. I like that idea. Hogbite. Begins to put an ambush together as well. Central withdraws. And another ambush. Got a bead on them. Very good hit. Love it. Overwatch has worked so well. Not much we can do about that explosion damage they're using rockets and uh, they just have the superior weapons or at least pretty damn good weapons up by charges in Gets the guy down to 1 HP. Takes a little bit cover. Good. Uh, you know... Central has an easy job, rally everyone, and then basically just heal himself. What is his debuff? Viking funeral. That is the downside of his trait. Okay. Fair enough. Didn't hit him. But we critted him. Which is okay, I suppose. One. Charges up.
Hits an ox bomber. Crits him. And continues with a lot of really good hits. I like it. Murphy takes a good position over here. And I think we're just trying to eliminate one. Yep, breather gone. That's good. Which then brings us to... Snowball throwing. And not having enough AP. Okay, cool. Ramos repositions for a kill. Fortunately, gets uh, poisoned in the meantime. Uh oh. Quan needs to heal. This is bad. Can't keep me down. Gotta hate healing clones. Everybody's just taking a lot of damage. That poison is so unbelievably annoying. And there's only so much you can do against a literal grenade thrower uh, that is shooting a rocket of poison into you. Good, let's take whatever we can. You saved all of the hostages is a achievement that we just got. a weapon mod and money that's not bad 
Every little bit of uh, cash helps. Okay. Well, we got all of the hostages, which means what it's time to talk. What in blazes did they... Which means it's time to talk to the guy who has the kill switch. Oh, they were applying gas to people. I don't think that's a very nice thing to do. All has such as accounted for. So you located and secured all five hostages? Outstanding. The man is gonna love hearing all about this once we get back to the Ranger HQ. Now let's keep your success going. Nice sharp Rangers. Alright. Gotta level up. Are we kicking in and go for ten strengths? Might as well. Because at that point, he just has a lot of hit points. And we're going for nerd stuff, plus one. Which then means we can finally read nerd stuff. Which also means we don't need the nerd stuff computer anymore. So, reviving an ally has a chance of buffing them. I think that is great because he is, at the end of the day, the guy that revives. I also like hacked robots uh, can be targets because that essentially gives us more on the battlefield. Uh, go, uh, go for hunter might not be a bad idea either. But I think we're going uh, for that physical therapy. I had my eye on that perk for a while. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Uh, we still got uh, something else than the computer, other than the computer to to wear. What else do we have? Melee damage? No. Oh wow. What's that? Downtime plus two and 50% crit resistance? You are kidding me, right? That is absolutely insane. That's 100% crit resistance on Central if I was to install it. Or on him. How much crit resistance does he have? Ten percent. That would also be very, very nice. But on Central, it would be absolutely fantastic. Well, that's a great item. Good, got some kisses, got some first med that we don't need. Hard S, really don't need any of that. We need to find items like this here, the sonic emitter, that actually does something. Cyborg tech is good. Potentially need to get more cyborg tech. I mean, look, we could get barter and perception, I suppose. Hmm. Okay, we got all of the hostages taken care of. Wait, there's still a medical crate. Anabolic injector, action. What? Action points plus one? Are you kidding me? Uh, just when we talked about 
what could uh, Marshall Kwon use? See, he's someone who definitely can use that extraction point. Deploys a lot of stuff, oftentimes need to run quite far. That's not bad, and once he has strength up, I think we're going to even give him more speed so that he's uh, quick on the battlefield. Tends to run quite a bit. Skywalkers, can we help healing vapor stream? Okay, so we're healed and ready. And we're going to mess up that Vic very, very, very badly. But before we're doing that, I have a bit of a bone to pick. job at saving all those hostages to be honest i really didn't want to uh in my defense i told you it was vic's orders i didn't want to kill anyone but i can help you now that you're here right i can give you the key to vic's place we can also take the key uh by force yeah you could definitely do that but i'm trying to surrender and like you gotta let me right I remember Victory's boys. This one's harmless compared to them. And he's nothing next to Vic himself. All right, arrest him. Wow. I was like mega sure I was dead there. You're good people. I mean that. Ow. Oh, I came up with it myself. I think that is... N hey, it's just what I believe. I was supposed to check in with our... Yes? But that wasn't my fault. Sure thing, boss. What do you... Well, uh... He's pretty... T he does a lot of drugs. A ton of drugs. And gladly. As for your ranger friends... Good. You got it, boss. I'll just stay right here. All right. If they surrender, we're, of course, going to let them. Death penalty is not a thing. Spectrum Assault Helmet. That is a great helmet. And another Power Armor. Hell yeah. Guess what Ramos is wearing? Damn right. It's Power Armor. Nuclear Knight's helmet's not bad, but the power armor helmet isn't bad either. Cold resistance, fire, explosive resistance. I think we're keeping that for now because 34 armor seems decent. We have really, really good armor overall. How much does power armor level eight strength? So I think uh, we're going to eight strengths with uh, central. I know I'm be building a lot of strength builds, but uh, it works. It works for once we are not being immediately destroyed and that's what counts right okay not making the same mistake as before Everybody else, uh, please follow. 
And can someone explain to me why Major Tomcat, one of our most prestigious comrades, is not healed up? I was just asking for trouble. Good. Let's start. Why is our clone, by the way, at 200 hit points? <sighs> All of these inadequacies. Good. Hawkeye charges in. Slaps that guy. Then gets. And then takes some cover. Ramos just deletes him. Ramos says, Vamanos, and that was it. Guess what, baby? That's what you get. I see Lambush here. Lucia self stims. And uh, then uh, prepares for an ambush. Central. Storms over. Can't really hit anyone up there. Nope. But what we can do is provide a nice little ambush. And finally, Quan. Good old Marshal Quan. Yet another ambush. It. I hate every little bit of getting poisoned. It sucks. It is unfair. Those guys, the Nox Bombers, they need to die first. They are just an absolute pain. And of course, all of the NPCs just run through the poison like it's no man's business. Good. Hogbite. Absolutely and 100% has enough of that bullcrap. Rushes. And you, my friend, are going to go down. Should have... Oh, we just found a trap. Great. Should have uh, taken a drink beforehand, but okay, it is what it is. All right, 
we can hit them without hitting the clone. One hit. Two hits. Hunkering down. Good. Now, Quan moves up. Hits this guy for free. And switches to healing the clone. Then continues to hit. Should have taken the second hit next because then we would have had a guaranteed crit. Ramos charges up. Alright, Murphy, what's it gonna be? Central Storms gets a free hit. Took the boss down apparently, which means everybody else is gonna be ecstatic about it. Charges up. And has a bit of a tough time hitting that breather for whatever reason. But still decides to do that. Why can't we heal ourselves? So Murphy, you're telling me that you are not allowed to heal yourself. Well, okay, that makes more sense. Finally, you are allowed to heal yourself. And this guy here gets a demoralization. Okay, cool. Now you know. Decent turn overall. Everybody gets rallied. Hog bite. <laughs> Did you just kill my personal guard? They were my best friends from fucking childhood, man. I. I. Holy shit. I can't remember their names. Good. Tundra Rifle. Unfortunately not as good as I hope it would be. Um, who needs a healing? Major is okay, that's okay. Razor Beak might need a healing. And the Provost might need one as well. do we have a bit of healing tank armor we got better stuff at the moment already uh, 
Uh, and that growler cup. This is draining our resources. And Major Tom. Good, we're healing up. Took quite a few resources. Good, what's your story? She's seated, hands locked into fists, uh, sweating and blazing in the heat from the fire. A glass of water lies untouched on the table behind her. Headless corpses slum in the chairs down the table. She ex ignores it. Two empty chairs are labeled with reserved signs. She ignores them as well. Gwendolyn Reed. She's head of the Reed family. And my ex-boyfriend's mother. She's terrible. You're not one of Victory's thugs. Ah. You're the rangers that Saul Buchanan sent for. Months ago, if I recall. Where are my daughters? Are they safe? Took us time. Um... So yeah, yes, we rescued them. Had me sitting here for days, threatening to fill those empty chairs with my headless daughters, while you frolicked in the snow. Well, that is a very nice I welcome. Will have words with Saul Buchanan about the punctuality of his servants. Make no mistake. Now go take care of his infantile son, if you can even manage that. You remember Lucia, don't you? What are you doing? We'll get you out of this, Mrs. Reed. As if your word means a stone nickel to me. Mrs. Reed didn't approve of Isaac and me. As if I wasn't good enough for her coward of a son. Who's the dead man at the table? Brother. Victory Buchanan found it amusing to saw off my brother's head. In Why do you think Victory me? forced you to sit it's here? Some petty revenge for a well-deserved slight I paid him at some dinner or another years ago. I embarrassed him by asking him a simple question he had no answer to, then told him he didn't deserve a place at the table. This, I suppose, is his little joke. Well, you're not a great person either, but I see no reason to harm you. Okay, we could have gone up here, I see. That was the little uh, side alleyway that we could have taken. Instead of rushing through all of the traps. Okay, I think Vic, it is time that we have a bit of a conversation. Hey, strangers! Shit! Cook rangers, let's not waste time talking. Play it safe, Rangers. Yeah, come on in. Fire, huh? Wow. Hey, hey, look who it is, Clarence. Daddy's Rangers. <laughs> in the flesh. The Rangers? I heard they were a bunch of little fucking chicken shits. Okay, he's depicted l as the most crazy there is. Oh, fucking hilarious. I know it was hard to get here, and no offense, but you can fuck right off back to Colorado Springs and tell Daddy you failed. I like it here. Who is Clarence? You know, my friend Clarence here. What? You don't see him? Oh, shit. Am I seeing things again? Hold on. No, 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 no. You, you're here, Clarence. Woo. Oh, gave me a scare there, chicken shits. <laughs> now, get the fuck out of here. Put your weapons down and surrender. Rangers... I have to level with you. That sounds fucking boring. <laughs> Why would I do that? The gift turned on you. 
I can tell from looking at your eyes you've been using the gases. We need you to get to a doctor. Nah, no way. Clarence here has been breathing that stuff for ages, and he's fit as a fiddle. Aren't you, Clarence? 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 Oh, no! Oh, Clarence! He was two days away from retirement! Ah, it's just me then, huh? Fine. You got me, Rangers. Now what? Surrender. Oh, that it? Sure thing, officers. Oh, but hold on. Before you slap the cuffs on, I have a... Hmm, what's the word? A proposition for you. You can suck your proposition. Don't lock me up. Take me with you. And I'll give you the VIP tour of... Everyone here knows me. Everyone's fucking terrified of me. And that means they'll be terrified of you. Good depiction of an absolute insane man. Well, at least I tried. Take me away from all this, officer. Copy November one. What a crazy lunatic. Go ahead. We placed Vic uh, Buchanan under arrest, sent a team to pick him up and ask him. Great job, November one. Colorado will be better off with that guy behind bars. Over and out. Ooh, we got a toaster repair for once. And we got a little item. And leadership. Great. Plus, oh, polar vo uh, mm, vortex. Okay, well, that is absolutely insane. Let's go. So, leadership, we already got at nine, which means, dear little book, you were what I was looking for. There we go. Leadership. Feels so good. So then, what's this? Energy cells, but I suppose it's a very good weapon. Oh yeah, it's a very good weapon. Oh yeah, it is a very good weapon. Okay. Yeah. Love it. I know those names. Those... Those are the poor ladies who married the Patriarch. Every last one of them, dead. Uh, Patrick's writing slanted, rushed, almost dismissive. Colorado Springs, Northwest Park. Quinn's Bushes, okay. And Livia, near the Hoon's resident. Okay, so we could unbury his killed ex-wives. Ooh, K-Cannon revolver. Okay, let's effing go. That pistol is astonishingly good. Breathing. Let me the rest to me. 
Okay, once we do have the ability to lockpick that, we'll come back. Seems like a great option. And we definitely need more energy cells because I can already tell that we don't have enough of them. There you are, Rangers. Good to see you. Yeah. Before you head Ditto. out, I have You're something to right. ask you. If I go back to Ranger HQ now, I'll probably end up in a room doing lab work. I'd rather take my chances out there with you. There are some things you just can't learn and glad to join your team. All right, for now. Welcome on board. See you at HQ Rangers. Uh, what a day. Uh, I need, uh, what a day. Uh, I need a fucking drink. So how do we get in here? She has the atomizer. What kind of gun is that? Okay, level 13. And what kind of gal is she? A little bit everything. Automatic weapon, nerd stuff, first aid. Tell you what, she has 12 points left over. I'm wondering, can... That's potentially not enough. Well, maybe it is. Let's get higher intelligence. Okay, cool. Many skill points, 14. I was just thinking about, can we get lockpicks? Not even close. Okay, and I don't want to destroy her build. She might be helpful at some point. Can't attack that thing. Can't get behind the fireplace, although it would be cool. Okay, I think, uh, ladies and gentlemen, this is where we're going to cut it close. Um, as always, it has been fun. Thanks a lot for watching and uh, see you all in the next episode. And don't forget, don't be as, be as crazy as Vic Buchanan. If you spot someone who is inhaling gas, report it to the like button and see you in the next episode. Bye bye.